morning, man. And isn't, isn't it a lovely morning? morning? Yeah, that's what that's from. A bobcat is on the loose in northeast Georgia. And that may not sound like much, but when you find out this bobcat has attacked two children and two dogs and has rabies. Not only does this bobcat have rabies, but it is still on the loose. Now, bobcat may not sound like much to you. They get pretty big and are well known to take down deer. So imagine a rabies aggressive cat going for your jugular and taking you down. So if you're in Winterfield, Georgia, right outside of Athens, keep an eye out. And if you see any cats, stay away because that is not something you want to mess with. Next in the news, in Australia, we got some horny crocodiles. At the Karuna Crocodile Farm in Queensland, Australia, a Chinook helicopter made a low pass. Low enough that the people on board could get some photos. As the helicopter flew over, crocodiles started going kind of crazy, started bellowing up at the sky. And as soon as the helicopter left, and I quote, all of the big males got up and roared and bellowed up at the sky. And then after the helicopters left, they mated like mad. There's something about the sonic waves that really gets them stirred up. The thought is due to the fact that many animals can feel the barometric pressure changes, these crocs might have felt like a coming thunderstorm was happening. And thunderstorms oftentimes trigger breeding in the crocodiles so basically they were gaslit into getting it on and last but certainly not least eris is going to a frenzy because there has been a bed bugs epidemic and they're notoriously difficult to get rid of it was reported that in may this infestation started at a hospital and quickly spread there are concerns that they might spread staph infection and the problem is so bad that the people of Paris are literally throwing mattresses in the street. There's thoughts that this issue could spread far outside of Paris. The UK is starting to get concerned because they don't want the situation coming back to them. There's just something about Europe and biting insects that doesn't exactly sit well with people. Now, thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you like this style of video. Let me know what you think down below, and I'll see you on the next one. Keep it wild.